I'm taking a stand on the climate crisis because I want a better and safe planet. I am taking a stand because I am from one of the most vulnerable countries and it is very frustrating that none of it is our fault. Within the first few weeks of starting medical school, I became aware that climate change is the biggest global health threat of the 21st century. And through that, I realized that no matter what I did clinically, that it would be overwhelmed um, by the impacts uh, related to climate change. Currently within the health space, we are seeing a lot of increase in diseases. For example, the non-communicable diseases and a lot of mental health uh, related issues. Uh, we have increase in displacement, we have um, increase in heat, um, which all affect people's mental issues differently. From most of the conversations I've had with friends um, who work in the climate environment, the first thing that we talk about is the echo anxiety that comes from um, people being afraid of what um, they could possibly experience in the future. We've got a very small window of opportunity at the moment to do something and not enough is being done to help tackle the climate crisis. We need to adapt and mitigate the effects of climate change. Policymakers need to translate their commitments into actions because they have made commitments already but they are not translating them into real actions in their countries. We want governments to focus more on having public transportation, encouraging their citizens to consume less meat. We want intergovernmental bodies to have guidelines to follow up on governments, to follow up on national societies to encourage them to actually alleviate this climate crisis. If policies can begin to look into more cleaner, healthy, safer methods for cooking, many people would benefit both from an environmental health perspective, but also human health perspective. Now is the time to take action, especially at a policy level. And I think that the more that we delay this, um, the faster the effects will be seen in many vulnerable populations. I'd like to see more um, young people go out in the streets, meet politicians, meet these big um, industries, and tell them to stop, you know, stop harming the planet, stop harming the people.